time to go out there and ball, man. Ain't no stopping us tonight. None, baby. It's on. And now for our feature presentation. What's good everybody, I'm back again with another video and Michael Wade Jr. is getting ready to have fun at Wale's album release party for the album The Gifted but he's got some unfinished business first with the Washington Wizards so he got Wale sitting courtside checking him out Y'all know Michael Wade Jr. always puts on a show for the celebrities. The signature skills that he's rocking this game are brought to you by Dorian Johnson. So remember to write down your signature skills for the next game. So we start the game off and Bradley Bill's trying to post me up. Come on, man. You're 6'3", I'm 6'7". No problem for Bradley Bill. So you know me, I gotta come back and respond. He just gonna pull up a J in my face and you think I ain't gonna do anything about it? Coach, I call the plays. I told him I'm getting the post up. So I go down to the block, I give him that work, give him the up and under Kevin McHale style, and I get the bucket, get my revenge. And now, we're pushing the rock around. I come off the screen, and Vucevic is like, hey, I'm wide open. I miss him for a second, but I still get the pass there because the defender's not even paying attention with his back turn. But right here, I'm setting him up with the jab step too quick. Finishing with a little teardrop right in front of the goal. Your boy was killing Bradley Bill and anybody they matched up against me. I couldn't be stopped, man. I was too hyped up for that party. They already double teaming me. They're double teaming me and leaving Steph Curry wide open. You know they have issues right now in the Verizon Center. So now Ty Lawson's on the block trying to front me, and we rotate the ball around, and I still get the layup to go because of me selling him off on the inside. And right here, he's setting a pick for me, and we're a patient. He gets the rock and makes the extra pass. I get the pass to assist. I'm cool with that. That little green bar moved up just a little bit. Man, it don't bother me any. And right here, we run a play, and I get the alley-oop. You know I was a Clippers guy, but now I'm a New York Knick. Law City East is where it's at. And as we play good defense right here, we're just going to stand still. Let's face pump fake 19 times. I get the rebound. I kick it up. And I'm the trailer now on the transition break. And I pull up for the three and get a bang, bang to the goal. Pointing to the crowd, telling them the Verizon Center. I'm an AT&T guy. I told him that. Right here, I go through. And the man's overcommitting again. I come back to the ball and make the bucket. He overplayed the play, so I decided to turn around and get the ball and get the bucket. And this time, he's trailing on the double screen and I get another alley-oop Lob City East once again and now I'm back on the block quick move before the double team can come and look at that dunk who did that remind you of Dwight Howard Shaq who did that remind you of I gave him a little thrust at the end and right here I'm stripping them active hands I don't even have the signature skill and I'm getting it and we're running up the court and I'm making my move. I got ankle breaker. He can't handle me. And I go in. Facebook dunk package. Let's go. And I get a fat head right there. And I'm calling a timeout for the Wizards. I'm toying with the Wizards telling them they need a timeout. I want to call it for them. And this was the weakest double team as I get this nasty windmill to go. Your boy is doing big things, man. He's showing that he can hop in the CDC and in my career for you guys. As we get this pass to assist as Steph Curry wanted to post up, he saw my success on the block. He's like, hey, let me go down there and have some fun. And now I'm blowing by him again. The double team comes. Hobbs is a smart player. Cuts down the middle of the lane for the wide open layup. I love when my teammates do that. When they stand still on the three-point line for no reason, I can't I can't do anything about it. I tell Lucevic to cut. He finds me right back, and I get the nasty windmill to go again. The give and go, and your boy is about to fly for the show. That was a break. Terrific start to the third quarter. And now, they don't know what to do, man. They're playing off of me, so I pulled up. Bang, bang, right into his face. It's like, dude, this dude is killing us inside and out. 
The Wizards have no clue what I'm going to do next. They don't know if I'm going to go inside, but what I'm going to do is swing that ball around and we get this nice jumper from Jeff Money Green as I get the pass to assist once again. If this was hockey, I would have about 30 assists a game. As I make my move, showing them my strength, telling them to eat his Wheaties, they have no one on this team to can guard me. If Wes Unsell came back and played for him, they might have somebody on that post to can guard me. But right here, they know I'm going around for the screen. He overcommits. I step back. I pop the three for the bang bang. And then I point at my boy Wale on the sideline and I run back down the court. Oh man, with the violent putback to finish it off. And I'm playing good defense right here, forcing a horrible shot. Straight up again. Hobbs with the huge block. I'm running up the court. I'm calling for it. It's late. I'm making my move. Step back, fade away three. Bang bang. Man, there's nothing else I can say, dude. Just ready for this party now. Only up two, so we got to put it away. As I get this alley-oop to go from Steph Curry. Kevin, what I like about him is that he just has a And as you see, that lead just grows slowly. It's going to grow slowly, but we need it to. As we get this steal right here, and this is the very next possession. I throw it up to Stucky. Stucky, lob that thing up to your boy. Lob City East is back once again. Your boy was feeling froggy. Call me Kermit. Man, they just couldn't check your boy in the fourth. And I make the move again. I kick it to Vucevic. And that boy's got a smooth mid-range jumper. I love having a power forward and center that can knock that shot down for me. And now that we got a big lead, I'm resting in the corner. I'm going to see what they're going to do. Vucevic is feeling himself right now. After that jump shot, he said, I'm going to go down there and give me a dunk. As we play good D right here, I get the rebound. A little tired, so I give it up. And in transition, they don't pick your boy up once again. And I give him another bang, bang. And it's official. Your boy is going to get a chance to go celebrate with Wale. We got the dub. That's all that matters. Y'all be good. I'll have another video out real soon. Your teammates were raving about your overall level of play in tonight's win. Did you feel like your strong performance ultimately led the team to victory? They were raving, huh? I find that hard to believe. Sounds like typical media-driven hyperbole to me. Who was it then? Hmm? Yeah, I didn't think you'd have a name. Let me just tell you one thing then. This team's all about winning. I don't think it matters to any one of these guys what an individual teammate does as long as we end up on the right side of the final score. And since we did that tonight, I don't think anyone's too caught up in my stat line or anyone else's.